All right, so I will be um, showing you some more functionality in Para 3D 4.0. Um, basically, we just have a para node with a linear controller, and all we've done is set up a basic cube. And what I want to show you guys is the new naming convention within the array. So if we're to look here, dimension 1, dimension 2, dimension 3, I've got three discrete numbers, 4, 6, and 3, which is reflected in the array. And the new feature is um, essentially the naming convention. So if I were to select one cube within the array and I were to go uh, check at the, at the reference box up here, I could see that this, is, this number here represents index 1, this number here represents index 2, and this represents index 3 and this is just the um, the naming convention of the first cube I made and also remember that these dimensions don't necessarily um, line up with the world coordinate system so this could this could be uh, different this is a pretty basic array so it looks like it could but it doesn't necessarily have to so to show you guys an example really quickly if I start with the corner we'll see that the index reads 1 1 1 as I were to shift through the array you'll see that index number 1 shifts to uh, the number 2 as I move through the other side, along the long side, you'll see how index 2 shifts to number 2. And as I move vertically, um, you can see that index 3 moves to number 2, and so on and so forth. So um, this is a new naming convention in Para 3D 4.0.